Race number six, another of the races in memory of the Hayes family who founded the Ducoin State Fair and built it into what it is today. Here's the field for race number six, the two-year-old race for Philly Pacers. One is Call Me Amazing, owned by Marshall and Lois Field of Rochester Hills, Michigan. Chris Boring Trains, Tony Morgan Drives. 1A, Coupled in the Wagering, Skirt Alert, owned by the Fields. Chris Boring, also the trainer, Mike Lachance, the driver. Two Star That Shines, owned by Tom Crouch, James Thomas, and Brian Penske Stable Inc. of Kentucky, Florida, and Illinois. Penske Trains, Eric Ledford gets the call. 2A, Katera Hanover, owned by the Penske Stable Inc. by Matthias Menzinger and Samson Street Stable of Illinois, New York, and Pennsylvania. Brian Penske Trains and Drives. Three Katie Ken Scoot, owned by Ron Smigielski. Richard and Ruth Sudam of Illinois. Jim Ferguson, the trainer, with Mike Cox. Four Dancing Beauty, owned by Ducoin, Sean Nessa, by John Nessa of Altamont. John Nessa trains. Tim Tietrich is up. Five Sneakin' Suspicion, owned by John Leahy of Westchester. Joe Anderson, the trainer, with Ryan Anderson in the bike. Six Spicy Spirit, owned by David Scharf of New York, New York. Jerry Silva of Belmore, New York. Joe Anderson trains. Dave McGee will drive. And number seven, Lady Loves Diamonds, owned by the Mamade Stable of Lexington. Steve Waller trains John Campbell, drives Lady Loves Diamonds. Nine fillies in only three minutes. Short post, three minutes. Pacing fillies are at the post and the gate is moving. Here they come. Off stride, Spicy Spirit. They're off and pacing from the outside. There goes Katera Hanover along with her. Skirt alert as that field thunders into the first turn. Rough gated at the start as they drive that way. A star that shines. And now she took a couple of bad steps. Drops back in the field on the inside. Getting to the front as they race toward the quarter mile station. Katie can scoot with that lead momentary on the outside. There goes skirt alert. She takes over. Here comes Katera Hanover right behind her. Moving up. She's third. Now second. And to the inside. Dropped in fourth as they swing around the turn is Call Me Amazing. They've just reached the quarter. Moving on the the outside very quickly as they race past that mark comes Lady Loves Diamonds. She was back in the pack. Now she's fourth on the outside. Here she comes for Campbell. Was fourth. Now third. Now second. And she moves alongside the leader off that 28 second front quarter. Lady Loves Diamonds rolls to the front. And she takes command now before the half mile mark. Second, Katera Hanover. Third, Skirt Alert. Four is Katie Can Scoot. Five to the outside. Call Me Amazing. Following her, racing six now. As they reach that mark is Dancing Beauty on the inside. Next as they race past the half, a star that shines. They were there in 56-2. They're in the upper turn, racing toward the three-quarter mile mark. Everybody in it except uh, the early uh, spicy spirit who made a break, and now as they race toward the three-quarter, Lady Loves Diamonds has the field behind her by a length and a half. Racing second, Katera Hanover. She'll soon move to the outside. On the extreme outside, moving up, here comes Call Me Amazing Morgan. Their position ready to strike, two wide on the outside, and from way, way back underway, here comes Sneakin' Suspicion. She has a lot of pace, and Anderson has her in gear. They're past three-quarters, 126, top of the lane. They turn for home. Lady Loves Diamonds, and on the outside, coming on down the lane, is Call Me Amazing. They race to the wire. Lady Loves Diamonds as they race this way. Lady, Lady Loves Diamonds. Here comes a late move by Dancing Beauty on the outside. Coming on the Dancing Beauty on the inside. Lady Loves Diamonds. Lady Loves Diamonds. Dancing Beauty in a good mile. Second. Katera Hanover was third. Sneaking Suspicion four. It appeared to be Skirt Alert over. Call Me Amazing for the final check. Finishing seven was Star That Shines. 8 to Katie Can Scoot, 9 after an early break, Spicy Spirit. Lady Loves Diamonds, 154 and 4 over locally owned Dancing Beauty. Here's the winner of the Hayes Memorial for two year old pacing fillies from the Mamaid Stable of Lexington, Kentucky. Trained by Steve Waller, driven by the sports leading driver, John Campbell, Lady Loves Diamonds.
Winning filly, a two-year-old Arts Place daughter of Yankee Blossom by Jate Lobel. So again, the Jate Lobel influence felt here as the mother of this filly by that same sire. Brenda Watson of the Illinois Harness Horsemen Association takes the blanket and hands it to the groom of Lady Loves Diamonds. And there she is, more than $100 million to the credit of that gentleman behind her, John Gamble, Lady Loves Diamonds. <laughs> 